Today, idag, we will continue here in Psalm chapter 4. Idag fortsätter vi i Psalm 4. So if you have your Bible with you, så du har Bibeln med dig, so let us open in Psalm chapter 4, i kapitel 4, and verse 3. Vers 3. It says this, it says that, uh, maybe I shall see it too. <laughs> Are you ready to? I'm ready. Praise God. What a blessing. Know that, the, uh, from verse 3, know that the Lord has set apart the godly, uh, godly for himself. Besinna dock att Herren har utvalt hos sig den trone. So God has set apart. Så Gud har satt det vid sidan. The godly one. De är gudaktiga. Wow. Amen. Amen. Så so you are among them that he put aside. Mm -hmm. Så ni är bland dem som är i satt åt sidan. That he have put to himself. Som han har satt in för sig själv. Think about that. You. Du. Exactly you, du. sitting here today, Så sitter här idag. he have put you aside Han har satt dig sidan. for himself. För honom själv. Wow. That's very special. We are special. Because you, you sometimes you're thinking, Ibland tänker vi. I'm not something special. Att jag inte är speciell. I'm only ordinary. Jag är bara vanlig. If you're Swedish. Du är svensk. <laughs> you're ordinary svensson. Så du är en svensson. Så vad är special with me? Så vad är speciellt med mig? If you have said yes and believe in Christ Jesus. Om du har sagt ja och tro på Jesus. And uh, confess that he is the son of God. Bekänna honom som son till Gud. You are very special. Så är det speciellt. Because God look on you. För Gud ser det. And says, I take this person to my side. Amen. Att jag tar den här personen till mig. For myself. För mig själv. I, I keep that. him. Behåll honom. For myself. För mig själv. Think God. Gud. Look at you. Se på dig. And say, that's mine. Det är han är min. And Paul is right that. He has given us the right to call us the child of God. Amen. And he adopted us to have all the rights as his child. Amen. We was not, but we become. Because our faith in Jesus Christ. The first born the first brother, among many brothers. Mm -hmm. And who is many brothers? We brothers and brother. It must be you and me. <laughs> <Us>. <laughs> the one that he has put beside. Hallelujah. And then he continues here. So fortsatan. The Lord will hear when I Call him. Amen. Ooh, hallelujah. Wow. He don't only keep you for himself. He says if you talk to me. Om du talar till mig. I will hear you. Amen. Wow. That is so powerful. That's you know. That's the the most privilege and biggest privilege any one of us has that we can speak we can tell him, and he or listen to us. And help us. The creator Skapen. of the whole universe, the whole universe on the ground that you walk on and yourself the creator Skapen. says 
säger I will listen to you. Jag ska lyssna på dig. He is not so big. Han är inte så stor. That he cannot hear you. Att han inte kan höra dig. But on the same time, Samtidigt. he is big enough så han stod nog to save you in every situation. Amen. Att rädda från varje situation. Det är inte underbart. And he continued. Och han fortsatte. And he he coming here with a warning. Han kommer med en varning. To you and me. För dig och mig. Because of what we are in him. För den vi är i honom. That in your anger, do not sin. I din ilska, synda inte. When you are on your beds, search your hearts and be silent. Tänk efter i era hjärtan på era bäddar och var stilla. Amen. Offer right sacrifice and trust in the Lord. Many are asking, who can show us any good? Let the light of your face shine upon us, O Lord. You have filled my heart with greater joy than when the grain and the new wine abound. I will lay down and sleep in peace, for you alone, O Lord, make me dwell in safety. Sila, offra rätt offer och förtrösta på Herren. Många säger, vem ska låta oss se det som är gott? Upplyft du över oss ditt ansiktets ljus, O Herre. Du ger mig glädje i hjärtat, större än andras. När det får säd och vin i myckenhet. I frid vill jag lägga mig ner. Och i frid ska jag somna in. Till du herre låter mig bo avskild och i trygghet. Amen. He lets you dwell in safety. Han låter dig vila i säkerhet. But he says here. Han säger. When you are on your beds. När du är på bädden. Search your heart and be silent. Så det är ett hjärta att vara tyst. To shake out yourself. Att ransaka sig själv. Because first he says what you are. Först säger han det du är. Because it's very good to know who you are. Det är bra att veta vem du är. Before you start to search yourself. Innan du börjar ransaka dig själv. But you need to search yourself. Du behöver se hur du själv. So you can give the right offering to him. Så du kan ge rätt offer till honom. To shake yourself. Att kolla över sig själv. What's going on in my life? Vad sker i mitt liv? What's happened in my life? Vad händer? Because things happen in our life all the time. Saker händer hela tiden. Things going on. Saker pågår. So, but he says that take time to be silent. Ta tid och var tyst. Take time to shake out yourself. Ta tid och se över dig själv. And let His light shining into your darkest places in your life. Och låta hans ljus lysa i ditt mörka i ditt liv. Because that can be very important. Det kan vara viktigt. You know, as a, as a Christian. Som kristen. Is not to run. Han är inte om att springa. From blessings to blessings. Från välsignelse till välsignelse. We love that. We love to be in the blessings all the time. <laughs> And God has so many blessings for us. Oh, yeah. So it's no problem to be in his blessings. <laughs> But you know, between the blessings, <laughs> we need to have time to silence ourselves. <laughs> to really seek him. <laughs> to catch him. <laughs> what he has for us. <laughs> Not only that we can speak to him and he all time hear us. Inte bara att vi kan tala med honom hela tiden. But to see ourselves. Se oss själva. In his light. I hans ljus. In the light of his word. I hans ord. And what he has for us. Och vad han har för oss. What he have created for us. Vad han skapar för oss. Are that wonderful? Inte underbart. What he have done for us. Vad han har gjort för oss. That is so powerful. So we have to take a whole lifetime before we really understand it. Yeah, it's not, uh, you know, the older you be, you be, 
you more amazed will you be? You will be you more surprised. What he has really done for you. Amen. And and uh, he says that. Alltså, Take your time. Be silent. Ta tid och tyst. Let him doing the work in your life. Låt han göra sitt verk. Ephesians chapter 4 verse 26 says. Efesbrevet 4 säger. He says the same in your anger do not sin. Det är inte ska synda inte. Do not let the sun go down while you are still angry. And do not give the devil a foothold. Låt inte solen gå ner över er vrede. Ge inte djävulen något tillfälle. So if, you, if it happens something in your daytime. Om det händer någonting i dagtid. Maybe you should take time to make up that before you sleep. Så ta tid och reda ut det innan det är dags att sova. Because so you don't give any opportunity for the devil to destroy your life. Så du inte ger djävulen någon möjlighet att förstöra ditt liv. Because if you have things in our life. Om vi har saker i vårt liv. We start to keep things against someone. Om vi börjar ha saker emot folk. We give a foothold for the devil. Så ger vi djävulen utrymme. You say, oh, I have demons. Du kanske säger, jag har en demon. No, 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 I don't what I say. I don't say that. Det är inte vad jag säger. I say, say that you give him a foothold. Att du ger honom mark. You open up the door for him. Öppna dörren för honom. To have an influence in your life. Att kunna påverka ditt liv. And destroy relations in your life och förstöra relationer i ditt liv to destroy different areas in your life att förstöra vissa områden i ditt liv destroy the prayer answer that God have given to you att förstöra bönesvaret i dig because you let your anger för din ilska in a special situation in a special situation you allow that to stay in your life. You don't make up with it. You don't crush it down. And clean it up with the blood of Jesus Christ. Sometimes you need to clean up with that person too. If you have something against a person. Be sure that you in the front of the Lord forgive him Amen. but the second thing that you in person can forgive him too that's not all time so easy but it's so important to, give, to live in the flow of his blessings in your life Amen. And not give any foothold for the devil in your life. Och inte utrymme för djävulen. The devil he go around. Djävulen går runt. Like a roaring lion. Som ett rytande lejon. To seek who he can take. Som söker vem han kan ta. And who he seeking? Som söker han. He seeking the weak one. Yes. Den svaga ta. And who is the weak one? Vem är svag? That's the one that gave him a foothold. Det är de som ger han mark. So keep your door clean. Så so håll ditt liv rent. Amen. Amen. And in, in James chapter 1, verse 19 says this. Jakobs 26, 29, 19. My dear brothers, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. For a man's anger does not bring about the righteousness life that God desires. Therefore, get rid of all moral filth and the evil that is so pre prevalent 
and humble accept the word planted in you which can save you. Håll detta i minnet mina kära, kära bröder. Varje människa ska vara snar att höra, sen till att tala, sen till vrede. Till människas vrede åstadkommer inte det som är rättfärdigt inför Gud. Lägg därför bort allt det orena och det är mycket onda hos er. Och ta ödmjukt vara på ordet som är nedlagt i er och som förmår rädda era liv. Amen. Amen. Quick to listen. Snart till att lyssna. Slow to speak. Sen till att tala. Amen. Amen. That's something to learn. Det är någonting man vill lära sig. Because sometimes you, you like to say something about everything. Ibland vill man uttala sig om någonting. Alltid. <laughs> When you sit and listen. När man lyssnar. You, 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 in the middle, you, you're sitting there waiting to, to break so you can say something. Man väntar på en öppning för att säga någonting. <laughs> Your focus is to all time say something. Mm. Fokus är att alltid. But you don't know the most wise thing you can do. Det visas det. Is to listen. Att lyssna. Let people speak to the end. Låt dem tala till punkt. Before you say something at all. Om du säger någonting i taget. And that you, you need to train that. Man behöver träna sig på det. Because you are used to. Man är van. To speak. Att tala. To all, all time say something. Att inte säga någonting. To all time have a commentar for everything. Kommentera allt. I remember a very wise preacher. Jag kommer ihåg en vis predikant. An old preacher. En gammal man. He, he learned this when he was young. Han lärde det när han var ung. He, he read this verse. Han läste den värsta. And he said, God, you. I'm not good to be silent. Jag är inte bra på att vara tyst. I'm all time very fast to speak. Jag är snabb till att tala. And I know that every time my wife try to tell me something, Och när min fru försöker säga något, I all time break her off. Så avbryter jag. <laughs> And take over. Ta det här. So God help me. Hjälp mig här. To be slow to speak. Hjälp mig att vara sen till att tala. So it was his prayer to, the, uh, to God. Det var hans bön inför Gud. God help me to be slow to speak. Gud hjälp mig att vara sen till att Because that you have right in your word. För det står i ditt ord. That I shall be slow to speak. Att jag ska vara sen att tala. So, so help me God. Hjälp mig Gud. So he prayed that prayer. Så han bad den bönen. Couple of months later. Lite må- senare en månad. A wife come to him. Kom till hon. I have observed one thing. Jag har märkt en sak. You let me speak to the end. Du låter mig tala till punkt. Thank you. Tack. And this preacher, he go back to his prayer room. Han gick tillbaka till bönerum. And said, thank you Lord. Tack Herr. You have answered my prayer. Du har svarat på min bön. It's so important. It's so important. And you know, you help people. Du hjälper människor. When you let them speak to the end. När du låter dem tala till punkt. And not make it to a contest. Yeah. Och inte till tävling. Because many times when we talk with one another, Ofta när vi talar med varandra, we make it to a contest. Så blir det en tävling. To the, the one that have the, make the most greatest thing. Till den som gör det största av det hela. And the greatest things for the Lord. Den största saken för Herren. <laughs> Halleluja. And you know, the best thing you can do. Det bästa du kan göra. Listen. Lyssna. Amen. Han fortsätter. And slow to become angry. Och sen till vrede. That's not easy too. Det är inte alltid lätt det heller. But God can help you there too. Men Gud kan hjälpa dig. Amen. Amen. I don't say I'm perfect. Jag säger inte att jag är perfekt. But I have been better. Men jag har bättre. <laughs> Before I could, I was angry before you have end the meaning. <laughs> so I are in a meaning of all sleep. <laughs> But uh, little by little. Stay for stay. Amen. By his grace. You must know. Amen. But he says that you shall humble accept 
the word that is planted in you. Amen. So how are you overcome? How you will have the success? Before the success. And how can you see that you can succeed and be silent instead to be angry? You can look as for tears instead of be angry. Let His Word confirm you. Let His Word bekräfta dig. And change your life. For the next day. Amen. Amen. His Word. His Word. That you receive. So the third one. In humbleness. What that means? That you don't question every meaning that you read. Because we are so good on that. We are very good to question everything. Why? Now you shall receive it. And let it do the work in your life. Let that work step by step in your life. Step for step. Listen to the word. Listen to the word. Read the word. Learn the word. Every day. Every day. And let it do the work in your life. And let it do the work in your life. Because the word of God is given to us. It's given to us. To lead us and help us. To lead us and help us. And to give us the success. To give us success. To see us living in victory every day. At see us som segrare i livet varje dag. In every area. På alla områden. And we should never be afraid. Vi ska inte vara rädda. To be silent. Och att tysta. Check ourselves. Se oss själva. Or like Paul writing to the Romans. Är det som Paul skriver till romarna? Judge yourself. Döm dig själv. Judge your own doing. Dina egna göromål. Because many times, Often, I have observed that, so I said, that when we are angry on someone for something, when we are upon on our own, no, no, no. so it is something that we have problem with self. So I don't think we have problem with self. So if we really take the root of the troubles, so we throw the root of the problem in your own life, you take it with you. You can respect another people with the same problem. Så kan du respektera andra med samma problem. But you need to take the root in your own life. Men du behöver ta rot i din egen liv. And you do it through the word of God. Med Guds ord gör du det. And in your prayer to him. Genom bönen till honom. In trust and faith. I tro. Because we give our offering to him. Vi ger vårt offer till honom. In trust. I tro. In trust to him. I tro på honom. We don't do it because we shall do it. We do not do it because we must. Or if the pastor says we shall do it. Or if the pastor says we shall do it. We do it in trust. In trust to him. To him. That's what the word says. The word says. Then you act in line with his word. You are getting in line with his word. And you will see a breakthrough in your life. Oh yeah, but the coming in line. Amen. God bless you. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Can we stand up, everyone? We stand up, everyone. Hallelujah. Molly, you can start to play. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For you are here right now. To do how you see. You touch our heart. You know where you are. Oh, through your Holy Spirit, you do your work in our my sisters and brothers here. You know, Heli and the for our sisters and brothers. Oh, you 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 know their their situation. Do it their situation. You know what everyone is going through. Do it while I go in. And I thank you for that. You are doing your perfect work in everyone's life. Amen. Thank you for your perfect that you'll be able. Because all of us, we we belongs to you. You have put us aside for yourself. For the world. Oh, we are your children. We belong to you. To our faith in you, Jesus Christ. And if you have listened to this message today, and you don't have Jesus in your life, confess right now. 
say to him, say to him Jesus, here I am. Jesus, here I am. Oh, I will belong to you. Jag vill tillhöra dig. Oh, and I believe in you. Jag tror på dig. And I believe that you are the Son of God. Jag tror att du är Guds son. And that you are alive today. Du lever idag. You died on the cross for me. Du dog på korset för mig. But you are alive today. Du lever idag. Because and you will give me a totally new life. Du ger mig helt nytt liv. And cleanse me from all my sins. Och rena mig från all sin. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. And I thank you for our sisters and brothers here today. Tack för mina systrar och bröder här idag. Cleanse their life through your blood. Rena deras liv med ditt blod. Cleanse their life. Det är det. And give them a special time. En speciell tid. To be silenced for you. Att vara tyst med dig. To only listen to your voice. Att bara lyssna på ditt ord. To hear you. Att höra dig. And to see you. Och se dig. And be amazed of you. Amen. Och bli imponerad. In every area in the life. Bara någon gång. In the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Amen.